Good evening and welcome to our night prayer. God calls us chosen. He chooses us to spend time with him now. So take a moment, recognising his call to you. Grace and peace to you from God, our Father, and the Lord Jesus Christ. Romans 1 verse 7. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Our help is in the name of the Lord who made heaven and earth. So we bring to him all of this day the delights and the challenges. He knows has been involved in every bit. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. Another verse from one of the Psalms, as we look at a different verse throughout the coming weeks. Psalm 12, verse 1. Help, Lord, for no one is faithful any more. Those who are loyal have vanished from the human race. Help, Lord, for no one is faithful any more. Those who are loyal have vanished from the human race. I love the way the psalmist generalises so amazingly. And yet we all do that at times, don't we? Noticing and thinking everything is dreadful. Centuries ago, the psalmist was writing what people today would say. No one is faithful anymore. No one is loyal anymore. And yet we look and we see God's faithfulness and we see those who are loyal. But we can identify with those who found that everything is topsy-turvy, that there is nobody standing with them or for them. Certainly it was David's experience. It's that encouragement to us that we can bring the reality of what we're experiencing to him. We can cry to him for help when it seems that no one is helping and no one cares. The psalmist says, in the way he brings things, tell it as you're experiencing it, bring it as you're feeling it and know that he cares and he understands. So we pray. Loving God, thank you that you call us to come as we are. We don't have to get our prayer words right. We can just come and say, this is what it is like at the moment. Thank you too, that you have seen over generations, people's frustrations, with those around them. Help us to trust you. Help us to look for the good and help us to forgive in those places where we are let down. Amen. Visit this place, O Lord, we pray, and drive far from it the snares of the enemy. May your holy angels dwell with us in peace and may your blessing be always upon us, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep, for you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. Amen. And now may the God who understands, the God who knows where we have been let down, the God who alone is faithful, 
fill us afresh with hope and love. Amen. Bless you and sleep well.